What's up y'all? This video was all over the place so here I am in the beginning of the video and at the end of the video at the same time. <laughs> This is so clever. <laughs> Subscribe to Sheena Vici. I'm going to be uploading three times a week. I know I be saying that and then I go MIA, but I needed a mental break. I know y'all understand. And if you can't even be nosy, I hope you get what you're coming from and never come back. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I really mean it though. What's up brownies? It's Sheena Vici and I know, I know I've been gone but I'm back with a mukbang. And today I'm going to be eating um, Chick-fil-A. Y'all remember when I did that Chick-fil-A hack video? Um, and I made this. I, I've been eating it ever since. Like, I wouldn't care. But yeah, so we have some hot topics to talk about because the comment section was in shambles like a couple of weeks ago. So I'm going to answer most of those questions and yeah, we're going to get into it. So. This all this is is Chick-fil-A fries and I think this is a 30 piece nugget. Um, me and the kids we split it. I sanitize these because y'all know people put their hands on them. I just I don't trust it. So I sanitize this and my phone because I'm gonna be touching everything um while I'm eating. But let me load this up. And don't talk about my nails, y'all. I got my quarantine nails going on. <laughs> so this is uh, ketchup. I'm gonna need two and I couldn't get the thermostat at the freaking frame so <laughs> it's on this way y'all know I'm silly most of the comments were like where is Naveen did they get the D word um what's going on and honestly y'all most of the negative comments and most of the confused people were people that weren't even subscribed to the channel. So the brownies pretty much let, you know, um, negativity um, shine in the comment section. And that's no not normally not, uh, uh, uh. that's normally um, not the case on our channel. It's mostly positivity. Let me finish this first because I'm all over the place. Alright y'all, so my food is done. So it's buffalo sauce, ranch, Chick-fil-A sauce, and ketchup. So I'm going to get right into it. Um, months ago, Naveen and I made a video talking about the new changes that you guys were going to see um, on the channel and what was going to be happening. So the reason why Naveen isn't in the intro is because he simply is not going to be in the video. Like, he got some good stuff going on. He's working on music. He's working out. Um, all positivity so it just makes sense that he wouldn't be in the intro y'all this month ain't gonna be super choppy because I'm really trying to articulate my thoughts and I'm doing this and it's like I'm replying to all the comments at once so it is gonna be a bit choppy so forgive me but I'm gonna eat some of these doggone chicken nuggets Another question people were confused about was, why was I moving? What? Honestly, all the questions y'all had in the comment section, had already been answered. If y'all would have watched all the videos all the way through, which I understand, y'all got lives and stuff like that too, but I answered them. All right, so somebody said, I understand the part about Naveen focusing on his music career, but why is she buying her own place? And I said I addressed that in the vlog, and they was like, oh, I haven't gotten around to that yet. Um, 
yeah so my lease was up so that's why um i was getting another place it's because my lease was up not because i just left but with this quarantine crap and all this uh, i don't want to say quarantine i'm gonna get flat <laughs> but why why would you do that that may like why like you could just take some you don't have to snatch it i don't want to be in that footage too long because they think i'm gone <laughs> Um, somebody said never understood how youtubers open their personal life to an audience and then feel some type of way when we ask questions now I've been doing mukbangs for almost a year and there's nothing personal about really doing mukbangs like I I, I, I don't feel like I signed up for y'all to know my personal information I don't, I don't, I don't get that. And a lot of people say the same thing about like celebrities or movie stars and stuff like that. Like, oh, you, um, you guys are on social media, so I pretty much can be negative all I want. Your comment section is open. Like, it doesn't work like that. And it's like people take YouTube and then they stalk you on Twitter and, and Instagram just to be negative. And it's like we didn't sign up for that either. Like, where, where, where is the line drawn? in between personal information and what we should tell the audience like when we sign up and we press agree to terms on youtube what what do we have to share you get what i'm saying like it's like it's no line like some people just want to be invasive and know absolutely everything you know and it's like it doesn't really work like that and now i can get jiggy with like people that come and i let them into my home and they know personal information about me and we got that vibe and that relationship but it's like when it's on the internet y'all gotta understand that the internet is a dangerous place and you have to be selective with what you share on the internet because i don't know who's watching y'all know who's, who y'all looking at because it's just one of me and then thousands of y'all so y'all I didn't sign up. I didn't sign up for for me to tell y'all. Oh, um, I bought boobs today. I don't know. <laughs> Why did I say that? I didn't. You get what I'm saying? So another one said, "It's a stunt. They want more followers. How do you go from saying the most loving things about your husband and then say you're looking for a new place and not address um, people, not address that people are asking what happened? Y'all, please be smart." Um, more followers don't equate to more dollars or more. Like, I don't, I don't understand like why I would. Pre I don't understand more followers why. And for me, if y'all knew me and the way I work, I've never been the type that harp on like, oh, social media, blah blah blah. Uh, I want X amount of followers or like I love the close-knit personal okay that's gonna sound it's gonna it's gonna kind of uh, it's gonna undo what I just said about the personal part like oh y'all gotta understand social media um, about the followers I remember when we had 10,000 subscribers and I knew all the brownies by name pretty much i knew exactly who they are who they were the ones that comment the ones that come in a lot so it's like the more they come in it's like i started to have some type of like bond and it's like as you grow it's honestly nothing you could do about it but you kind of lose that so it's like having more followers for me um is bittersweet so i don't really understand that i honestly feel like being a smaller, which I am still a smaller YouTuber, but like a smaller, smaller, smaller YouTuber, it was more, you know, yeah, I don't know. I, I just, that, that's not what it is. It's, it's not. I'm a huge fan, but she's really making me not want to watch anymore by not, let, by not letting us know what's going on. I get it. It ain't our business, but why be a public figure and then not update certain things, especially like this? The, the issue was I already did. You guys just don't watch it. I already did. Like, what do I, what do I supposed to do? Like, comment below. Let me know what was I supposed to do. I already did it.
Where's Naveen is like he's gone and she's just doing videos like nothing happened. As a subscriber who likes to watch the family, I feel some type of way that she's moving forward without saying a word. I mean, you don't have to give details, but is he okay with all this corona? I ain't gonna say that word. Is he okay with all this going on out there? Are uh, y'all separating or have? I mean, just left us hanging. We are the ones that support the channel. <clears throat> Just saying it's getting frustrating to watch because we all love watching the Naveen as well. Okay guys, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to read the questions and answer everything y'all wanna know and then I'm gonna eat. So the mukbang, I will put a stamp, a time stamp. Um, yeah, so I, I understand if you're being concerned. If you're concerned, Brownie, I understand. But y'all, I'm telling y'all, most of these people do not care that it was in these comments. They do not care about where Naveen is or what's happening. I promise y'all, they're not even subscribed. They just want to see some drama and want some negativity. And negativity, honestly, outweighs positivity a lot of time. Most of the time. It's unfortunate, but that's just real. And I'm not naive enough to think that Everybody just care. Everybody just want to be nosy to know if I'm miserable or not. But fact is, I'm not. And the reason why, another thing, they was like, why is she so smiley? If, um, you know, he's not in the pictures, like Naveen filmed and edited the intro. Y'all was doing way too much. I was laughing. I was because in it. He was in the intro. <laughs> like, y'all was doing way too much. Y'all making, like, this is the OG Brown. Her name is Angela Williams. Shout out to you. And Emily, I'm gonna Emily, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say your last name, but I knew I was gonna jack it up. So it is schlocked. I think, yeah. Uh, somebody's like, y'all making my hair hurt. Sheena clearly said she'll speak on whatever when she's ready. Out of the near 800 comments, 650 are asking the same things. Please respect Sheena's privacy at this time. And I'm just kind of like, yeah. But thank but, you for that. Can I say something? Yeah, you should have been saying something all the time. Should I just start over? No. Because I ain't, <laughs> no, ain't no, eating none of this food. Too. I'm keeping all this in. Okay. <laughs> um, I feel like no matter what people are going to feel like, we have or are going through something. If anybody going through something, it's just me. Yeah. <laughs> I know, but it's like, at the end of the day, if all else fails, if I turn the audio on the intro, that's going to cut all that noise. Yeah, oh, wait, 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 wait. We got footage. But we got footage. It's just that you wasn't in the that, intro. That, that we took out, remember? I, I was vlogging, you was editing the intro, like, babe. But no, the footage, the other footage that we did, that we took out of the vlog, the vlog we did. Yeah, you was there the whole time. Yeah. You really put the arch in. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. My baby. Go ahead, go. Yeah, yeah. Go, baby. You for the fall, I just feel I it. Fall, really. Yeah. You idiot. Oh. Y'all, you ain't laying. You ain't stick it. It's stuck I in. Did, but <laughs> hold on, wait, 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 hold on. Hold your head down slightly. <laughs> so somebody else was saying, yeah, they even had ice cream before dinner. I mean, I'm not judging. I'll do the stop eating my food. I'll do the Naveen, come on, man. Well, I got a much Stop. Okay, good. <gasps> I thought you were putting it oh, back. Oh, oh, oh. I'm glad I can't even see you. So I was like, yeah, they even had ice cream before dinner. I mean, I'm not judging. I'll do the same thing. Um, what I'm saying is maybe they're treating them so, they're, so they don't get... Blah, blah, blah. That's how crazy this sounds. Maybe they're treating them so that they aren't upset about the split. That ice cream is made out of cashew milk. It is vegan ice cream. It's really nothing bad it's in there. It's a little taste of sugar in there. Like it's made from nuts and coconuts. Like y'all be reaching. Somebody said when a woman's fed up, it ain't nothing you can do about it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that might be true for some. Um, My kids can have ice cream before dinner because it's not deadly ice cream. <laughs> She's, somebody said, how we knows that she put up knowing questions will be asked. Doesn't mean she's going to answer, but she knew she, uh, we were going to ask and wonder uh, and say we are praying. I think she meant prying and all the other stuff. I see in the comments as I see other stuff in the com. I see other stuff 
and all the other stuff I see in the comments as I'm sure she see it I don't give a F if she responds or not doesn't change my question or anyone's questions about where the H Naveen is at um if you don't care if I respond or not why are you still asking me questions why did you ask the first question? Yeah, you know. like she said, how we how we knows him. Like my thing is like, my thing is I answered your questions don't know before. How to appreciate no good chicken nuggets. I'm gonna get. You. Do you want to be in this mud bay or no? Mm -mm, not even Cause you good. you're not even supposed to be here. <laughs> She, somebody said, haven't watched YouTube for, I guess, a few years. I noticed that it's unfortunate people have to or are willing to do things for clickbait. Maybe it's a sign we get too personal with folks that we really don't know. I feel played. And this was a moving in with my aunt. And um, I forgot what I titled it. But it, clickbait is when you click on a video and when you watch it, it doesn't match the thumbnail or the title. It was nothing clickbait about that video. Let me know if you got a different definition because it was nothing. You got what you clicked for. Um, don't know why YouTubers think they can open up their lives for money and then want privacy. <laughs> uh, you are selling your privacy for coin, so spill that tea on your why your main character, aka your man, is now missing from the intro and episode. Lord. Like I could tell this person is negative, and I could tell that they don't watch my channel, my channel at all. Um, but I didn't open up my, I didn't sell anything or my privacy. Look on the channel. Name five personal facts about me in a comment. And I promise you, if you could do that, personal facts, and I don't know you in real life, because <laughs> I know my family watched this, I will cash up you $100. Five personal facts. We have not really gotten that personal on YouTube. Actually... You know what? I'm going to ask five questions. And the person that get this right, these answers right, I will cash up you $100. Can I play? No. No. Where? What state do I live in? What is my middle name? What is my favorite food? Um. That third one, that ain't a fair question. That's not a fair, my favorite food? Yeah, but go ahead. You can keep um, two more, <laughs> two more personal questions. What was my last pet? And what was their name? My last pet. These are like security questions. I better be careful. <laughs> Sheesh. My last pet. I don't even know their names. Ooh. You remember our last yeah. pet? I remember your last pet. I ain't had no, we ain't had no pet together yet. Ooh. <laughs> we never had oh, pets today. We did, we did, we did, we did. Anywho, I don't, don't even know count. myself. That don't count. But anywho, that's what I'm saying. Like, y'all talking about I get personal. Like, oh, whoa, it's me on YouTube. Oh, my gosh, y'all. This happened today. Y'all, I've been eating on the camera for a long time. I haven't gotten the chance to be personal yet. By the way, follow my new channel, Shin VG. They oh, might be a different story. Oh, to minute number 30 to say something. I know, but I already know most people ain't even going to make it here. Yeah, true. And the other thing is, like, y'all be wanting personal, but y'all don't watch. You know what I'm saying? Like... Everybody else, everybody just wants to know are we together or not and they're gonna get the answer and then go on about your business Y'all just want to be nosy. I don't know what is wrong with people wanting people to be miserable It's like they negativity flock to it. Oh, she left him or oh this happened. It's like so much drama Y'all don't just take this. No, I don't thrive on drama. Naveen going on if you Naveen stop okay, 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 okay. Naveen, you making my now you messing up my aesthetics for real. Put that back. I'm serious, babe. For real, it's a gap in the plate, and I ain't even been eating. Ew. <laughs> All right. I don't know. I'm gonna have to do this video again tomorrow. No, I'm uploading this. Sir. I might not even edit. It. No, you gonna edit this? Mm -hmm. I don't even want to read these comments. It's just it's so draining. Fat cinnamon queen. So I said, like the the lockdown is getting people. Um, the lockdown is getting to people so much that they're thinking all manner of foolishness. Anyway, all right. So the mukbang is gonna start now. <laughs> I how to do part two, man. <laughs> Thank you for watching. <laughs> this cold. Uh uh. Heck no. All right.
I know <laughs> I know this is supposed to be a mukbang. Hear me out. Food is cold. Blank. Blame the people in the comment section. I'm sorry, y'all. And next time, if I already address something, I'm just not gonna address it. Um, if you knew, I would just make a playlist saying, "If you knew, watch this," <laughs> so that y'all can keep updated. Man, I don't even want this on my channel, man. Thank y'all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all next time. Hey. Peace. I'm finna do Wait, 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 wait. What you gonna do? This whole video over. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, so we can eat that. I'm really mad. Why? Because you messed up my aesthetics. I ain't messed up your aesthetics. Like, Look at it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, that almost came on here.